everyone, I'm Dasha, welcome to my channel. In this video I will show you how I painted Iron Man in MS Paint. A while back I saw the MS Paint Santa video by Eclectic Asylum Art and I thought that's a cool project I can do for my own channel. So I was thinking about what characters to draw and decided on Iron Man. I thought people might enjoy seeing something like this. I wanted to make a full illustration including a background. So I was looking for a reference and found this on Pinterest. I wanted a basic pose that would look good in a landscape format and the top of the image was a perfect fit, minus the wings. I started by making some simple sketches in MS Paint just to kind of get an overview of what Iron Man looks like to warm up. And then I began to paint the main image. I made the canvas 4K size so that I can add a lot of detail. So here I'm sketching things out to position him properly in the format. I'm sorry for the lower quality in the first half of the video. The recording was set to 1080p, but it looks more like 720p. I changed the recording software halfway through so later on it will be completely sharp. I added color swatches onto the canvas to make color picking easier here in MS Paint, especially in the beginning. Filling in the basic tones. Here I'm filling in basic tones all over the suit. I kept the reference image on my phone and it was very pixelated, so I had to assume details in some areas and improvise. Also, which part do you guys think was the most frustrating to paint? Let me know your guesses in the comments, I'll tell you the answer at the end of the video. Here things are already starting to look better, I'm refining the surfaces more and start working on the details on the golden parts. Here is some real-time footage, it's low FPS because I recorded this at a low FPS rate, but the speed is real. The process was extremely slow.
finishing some parts already, like the silver on arms and the arc reactor on his chest. Here I'm polishing the left shoulder plate, finished it and continued all over the suit.
So I'm going around at this point looking for things to fix so that I can finish the suit and move on to the background. The only thing I left unfinished is the gradient in the center of the chest. I'm starting the background. In the original reference the background is desaturated and I don't like it too much for this particular painting. I want something more vibrant. Uh, so I chose to do a more saturated blue background with blue flames. So I'm just going to improvise some flames. I'm filling it in with color. I want to keep it simple and not too overwhelming. It will be relatively dark compared to Iron Man because if I made it brighter the image would be too chaotic and the background would take attention away from him. I want him to stand out. So I'm blending the basic tones together to create some base for flames. The background actually took me around 20 hours. That's just the background alone. The main reason for that is because the brushes are small and the blending takes ages. I was initially planning to blend the background and make it smooth, but when I saw the flames, I like them and I thought this fits really well. Iron Man's suit is very smooth and reflective and glossy and then in the background the flames are wild and much more sketchy. I like it. I went to polish the chest area and remade the gradient on his chest, which was actually the most frustrating part of the image. And I don't mean the reactor, no, just the gradient around it. I think I spent around 10 hours on it and it sucked. Blending is time consuming here because of the brushes.
After that, I checked the entire piece for mistakes and it was finished. So it is finally done. I have 92 hours and 14 minutes of footage from the process, but I haven't recorded everything. For example, when I forgot to hit record, I'm guessing I worked around 5 hours more total. So that would be 97-ish hours, plus editing which took around 20 hours because I had over 300 clips to edit. So, this video took over 120 hours to produce. I am happy with the result, but most importantly, what about you guys? Do you like it or not? If you do, which part of the painting is your favorite and why? Let me know. Also, what other challenges do you want me to try? Let me know your suggestions in the comments. If you would like to see more of my videos, you can subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you have a beautiful day or night, and I will see you in the next video.